<laughs> what I say? What I say? This is the last round he wasn't making out of it. I had to go silent right there, but I was waiting for him to go. I was waiting for him to fucking do something. Give me some space and you're done for. Yeah. We're gonna go with Leonard here. Leonardo, sorry, not Leonard, huh? Leonardo. One thing I'm looking forward to in the Conor McGregor fight is the fact that he does not have uh, a lot of, I mean, he can grapple, but he's not a grappler. So he can do that all he wants and it's really not gonna help him as much as he may think, you know? But he's not going to because it's Conor McGregor. He's gonna try to knock me out. All right, here it is. We went on a podcast. We, we, we did everything. We predicted the fight. I did predict a second round knockout. Uh, posted to social media as much as possible as well while keeping 100% peak fitness. Santos, you better watch out. I'm not going out by a submission anymore. Anymore. Michael Kies is the only guy to be doing that to me, man. Only one. I'm not letting that shit happen anymore. This is our last fight before Conor McGregor. We got to make it a doozy. We got to make Conor a little nervous, if you know what I mean. He's he's going to be sweating bullets before he steps right, in the ring. Next, it's a UFC lightweight division bout. Let's see what we got for us, huh? I don't care about the walkout. I just want to see this. Dude's 43 years old. Holy shit. Same reach. I'm an inch taller, though. Okay. This can be tough because we're the same reach. I haven't had that yet, so. There we go. Oh, whoops. contenders fight in the UFC lightweight division if this man wins tonight he has been guaranteed by UFC president let's go White, a shot at the UFC lightweight title you know how hard title shots are to come by at 155 on. pounds he is one win away I'm one win away guys well he left his head open there Joe and he got cracked with that jab he was damn okay as long as we don't stay on the ground, I think I'll be fine because I can now kind of navigate it a little bit easier. I thought I hit that, or I thought I got that. Bro, like fuck. Like, what is going on? What is, what is my guy doing? Oh, and he eats a shot. Let's go. Come on. I'm ready to just... Big kick, but miss. Oh, straight right. Big shots. Oh, what a combination. There we go. I just get up. As he looks to improve position here. Good control. Postures up. Get a couple shots in there. Why not? Ooh, I tried it. I tried it. There we go. I'm not stopping. Come on. Come on. There we go. Look at that. We're stopping takedowns. We're doing everything we can right now. Trying to take the back here. And full back. Staying on top of him. Yeah, stay on top of him. Smush him. He's got half guard. Santos's lower jaw is extremely swollen now. Okay. I'm too tired. He's I'm too tired. No. No way. No way am I letting that happen. I'm just getting up. Fifteen seconds. Splits the guard and connects with the punch. Trying to pass here. We we held control. 
we hold control right there that's all that matters to the judges they don't care they don't care who i mean i defended the takedown i had control sure i was trying to get up but they don't see that part you know they just see he was on top he was beating the shit out of him i scored a knockdown don't get over aggressive i got this shit i got this i'm not i'm not touching your glove anymore fuck you okay okay never mind Yes. Let's go. Well, when this fighter first walked into Dutch strike team, the coaches weren't even sure he could make the UFC roster. Now they think he could be a future. What? Champion. All indications are he is in the best shape of his life in advance of this one. A scary proposition for the rest of this division. Full what? Okay. No panicking. Come on, let's just get up. Hip escape, nice hip escape. Now to full guard. Ooh, we got up. Okay. I was actually really nervous about not getting up right there. Able to check that kick as well. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Faints with the kick. And the takedown attempt, but he does not land it. Nice kick to the body. Okay, put your fucking hands up. That one hurt. Dude, every time I go for a kick, he goes for a kick. It's a, it's actually fucking annoying. My guy's walking backwards. Two minutes here to go in round two. Well, he eats a punch to the head there, Joe, and he would be wise to get his head off of that center line. It's almost as if he's moving straight into that punch. Oh, double jab. Oh. Oh. oh my god, someone, someone get the ambulance. Someone get the ambulance. Please. He does not look good. He does not look good. Someone get the ambulance. Look at that. The dude was, <laughs> he was trying to stay up. He was like, Ugh. he's like licking my sweat off of my leg. Thanks, pal. Now I don't need to take a shower. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, I, I think we're losing that though. Let's see. No, we were we're still winning. Judges still saw it as I was winning too. That's a good fight. I was nervous. Was that second round? I think that was second round knockout. Just like I said. Hell yeah! All right, this is it. We're going after Conor McGregor. Thank God I uh, I threw a couple of those uppercuts. He was going in for the takedown so often that I need I knew I needed to throw him more. <clears throat> it's still super hard for me to commentate while I fight though, because I have to focus so hard on the fight and like what's happening. I have to react. <gasps> we just hit a million followers on whatever social media that is. Can we do that in real life, please? Follow Tog's plays. On Twitter. Do it. I tweet a lot. I do tweet a lot. Connor McGrader. Ooh. What do you got for us, pal? What do you got for us? This is a high hype fight with a five week camp. Um, yeah. We gotta accept that shit. We're second right now in the rankings. Only under Connor. Only under Connor. Um Damn, I kind of want to go somewhere else, but at the same time, I don't really have anywhere else to go. I want to go here. This would be nasty. Uh, we're going to keep going to the Dutch strike team, I think. Actually, let's go crossbreed once once again. Because uh, <clears throat> they offer a wider variety of stuff that we haven't uh, maxed out yet. So we're going to keep going there. I'm going to show the two weeks like always, and then uh, we'll skip to the fight. 
Let's see. Gets his title shot in a grudge match against Conor McGregor. Let's see it. Let's see what we can do here. It's already a high high fight, so I really don't have to promote a whole lot, which is awesome. Our submission. Oh, yeah. Okay. Take down. Let's see. Take down defense. Damn, maybe not. Maybe all this stuff. Let's see, switch stance and endurance. Toughness and heart. See, this is the stuff that we need to work on right here. Toughness and heart. We're going to spend like two weeks doing that. Uh, Clinch throws and clinch grapple. Might as well start doing that as well. Okay, that one doesn't give me a whole lot. The bottom game and top game. We're going to try to get that to like a 94 before the end of the training as well. I can't believe we hit a million followers. That's awesome. Strike a vulnerability. All right. He's a striker. We're a brawler. This is like the, this is going to be the fight of a lifetime. It really is. He's going to be fast as fuck. I just know that. I'm going to be fast, but not nearly as fast as he is. Come on. Do something for me. Like, see, this is this is the fight I was hoping for. We just duke it out. Like, there's no going for takedowns. I mean, we might take each other down a couple times, but... Good block. God damn, he's fast, though. God Good damn. Block. Like, slow down a little bit. Oh. Okay. Oh, oh, I did not see that coming though. I'll be honest, I did not see that coming. All right, so we're at 93% moderate fitness. Let, let's see what the key to victory for this guy is, huh? Connor McGregor. What do you got? Your opponent has powerful straights and he will come fast. Keep distance and counter with left or right sways. Okay. Same key to victory as it was for Nate Diaz. And look where that got him. Knocked the fuck out. Knocked out, man. Clinch those clinch grapples. Sure, why not? All right, is there any mandatory uh, promoting we got to do before we continue training here? Not yet. All right. So essentially, go ahead, do a couple more of these. Top game, bottom game. Blocking is down. That's not good. Uh, takedown defense. Oh, we need to do toughness and heart. Before I forget, let's do that once, one time, huh? Where is it at? Toughness and heart, right there. All right, and we have some minor inju injuries. Hopefully, we can just do a uh, physical therapy and whatnot. All right, so we have two different things. Shit. Okay, that takes. That's like a week gone. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna do the rest of these weeks and try to promote the fight out just a little bit here uh, Probably just with these and uh, Best of luck, right? <laughs> I mean, we're facing Connor for the belt. We're about to be champions. I'll see you in the fight Here it is This is our title fight opportunity Who's hyped? I know the fans in this game are it's a very high hype fight and uh, apparently what happens is the higher hype fight it is, the more difficult it is to take that person down. So we're about to take on not only Conor McGregor, but Conor McGregor, who is furious about having this be a hyped fight. He does not think that we deserve the hype factor. Let's prove him wrong. Let's give them a show. I'm saying we stretch this out three rounds. Fighters fight for many different reasons. Some do it for the fame. Others do it for the money. I do it for the Eventually, money. all of that fades away. Yet going down in the history books as a UFC champion is something no one can ever take. It's proof that for a moment in time, out of all the fighters in your weight class, you were the best in the world. It's the culmination of all your hard work, the fulfillment of a dream. Tonight is your chance to take that gold belt 
and hear Bruce Buffer say, And, and new. new. That kind of glory lasts forever. The All right. So more than 10 years of I guess this is it, guys. This is it. With some differences in height. We're doing, uh, we're doing this. Come on, Connor. Touch gloves with me. All right, here we go. Will we crown a new there we go. Let's go. What do you got? It is time to find out. All right, so we'll I'm ready. What are you doing? Throw your kick, I dare you. Ooh, okay. There we go. This guy, uh, come on, Connor. Joe, what are you oh, for out of here? I'm so nervous. Connor's got some deadly ass kicks, though. <clears throat> as long as I don't waste too much stamina, we should be good. There we go. Come on. Show me what you got. Show me what you got, Connor. I know that's not all you got. Come on now. Okay, okay. I was kidding. Ooh. Come on. What you got? Corner. No. Don't do it to yourself. Oh, he missed that kick. Come on. Oh, that almost took me out. That almost took me out. God damn it, dude. Every time I go for a kick, he goes for a kick. Come on, no, no, Connor. Come on, I was expecting a better fight than that. I was expecting a better fight than that, Connor. Come on now, what's going on? Ooh. Ooh. All right, come on, come on, baby. Come on, let's see what's going on. And no! Let's go! Who's the champion? Who's the fucking champion? Yes. I am now a fucking champion. We had a rough patch, okay? Unfortunately, that rough patch was on stream. Everybody was doubting me. Everybody. I mean, shit, he threw some significant strikes. I gotta say, I was not expecting that many. 15 out of his 18 strikes were significant. That's crazy. There's no scoring, obviously. I mean, that was it. Connor, he, he put up a fight in the first round. And he got knocked the fuck out. I mean, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Let's see. We gained some fans. There are only 50,000. I mean, shit. All right. 81K in the bank, though. We're about to get a new contract. Let's see what you got, Megan, for me. Come on. Hype me up a little bit. Hey, everyone. I'm Megan Olivi, and it's time for your UFC Minute. The MMA world is buzzing about that incredible performance this past weekend in the main event. Last weekend at the Honda Center were. in Anaheim, California, it was a night to remember for the mixed martial artist whose story has captured the imagination of fans around the globe as he fought the fight of his life when it mattered the most. When the dust settled, Bruce Buffer said, and knew. And he was crowned UFC lightweight champion of the world thanks to a memorable referee. Don't stop it. saying it. Say it again, Megan. Say it again. That's it for today. Please. Stay tuned for your next UFC minute, and I'll see you at the fight. Who's the champion? I'm the champion. And new. Look at Conor McGregor, man. I mean, when you're. Th oh, shit. I just feel bad for the guy, you know? I just feel bad. I mean, look at that.
Nobody was stopping it. That was nasty. All right, new contract earned. I'm now a champ. I'm a superstar, baby. 80,000 to show up. I get 180,000 to win. That's crazy. Thanks. Tyron, Tyron Woodley. Hey, Togs. Isn't he uh, middleweight? Oh, shit. He is. I'm about to go for that. Uh, I'm about to go for the double belt. That is what what's next, right? It goes lightweight. No, it goes welterweight. That's what it is, right? I can't remember. I can't remember. We're going to go ahead. Uh, we're going to see who our next fight is. And we're just going to end the, the video here on the good note. Shh. <laughs> no. No. Habib. No. That's not fair, though. Look at his grappling. Look at it. You're expecting me to not get fucked in here? God damn it. All right. I guess we uh, we have our... Uh, we have we have a challenge for this this next fight for the next episode though so uh with that being said i hope you guys did enjoy if you did please leave a like subscribe if you are new and like always i'll see you in the next one peace